The word for today, God said, My thoughts are not like your thoughts. Just as the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my thoughts higher than your thoughts. Isaiah 55, 8-9 Until you come to terms with the fact that God doesn't think like you, you will question his ways and even doubt his love. We try to avoid pain, but often God uses it to bring us peace. We want comfort, but he is more interested in character. We pursue stuff that doesn't last, whereas he tells us to build our lives on that which endures for eternity. The fact is, God dwells in a dimension we can't begin to fathom. Solomon said, No one can really build a house for our God. Not even the highest of heavens can hold him. 2 Chronicles 2 verse 6 What controls you doesn't control God, and what worries you doesn't worry him. Is an eagle agitated by traffic? No, he soars above it. Is a whale disturbed by a hurricane? No, he dives beneath it. Is a lion flustered by a mouse standing in his way? No, he walks over it. How much more is God able to soar above, dive beneath, and walk over the troubles of earth? What is impossible with man is possible with God. See Matthew 19, 26. God can be everywhere at once, and he can hear and answer all the prayers that come to him. Think about it. God works according to a plan and a purpose. He's on the throne and in control of everything. Yet he still watches over every detail of your life. Let that truth comfort you today. And that is the word for today.